Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Raptor X here with Good Clean Gaming RX, and today we are back in Eco once again. The day has finally come that I have access to the Master Tracker License Certification, which, once completed, will allow me to take the Extreme Risk Target missions. So, I've gone ahead and accepted that, and we're going to go ahead and see if we can get that one completed. Um, I am doing this one in my Aegis Gladius, as that's the one that I feel most confident of it surviving, and actually being able to uh, come back from this, the mission without, uh, without being totally destroyed. Uh, these are all a significant distance away, so we're going to go ahead and use the OM points to jump around here. I am around the planet Microtech, uh, just leaving the space station of Port Tressler. I have set my spawn location uh, to the Port Tressler station, uh, just because... I'm not at all confident that I'll be able to beat this particular mission. Um, the extreme risk target ones are significantly harder uh, than 1,098. We'll go ahead and we'll warp to this one and then most of the way there we will kill power. which we can do by pressing the U button. There we go, perfect. And then we'll go ahead and turn on power. There we go. Swap all power to shields. And we'll go ahead and fly in the last hundred and ninety kilometers or so. So, with that in mind, uh, obviously I can't wait till the uh, till the quantum boost mechanism comes into play, where we'll actually be able to just point at that location, uh, spool up the quantum boost or quantum uh, control mode, and just stream along at, at super high speeds. I think they said like a tenth speed of quantum travel. Um, but unfortunately, we don't have that technology in the game quite yet. Uh, they are still building and developing that for Squadron 42, and that'll be added to the PU when they feel that it is complete and ready. Uh, so for now, I'm going to go ahead and pause recording, and we'll pick up once we are closer to the target location. Okay, so we are coming in now to the target location. This is actually, uh, I think, one of the first times that I've been over Microtech on the non-glaciated area of the planet. And uh, seeing this, I may have to uh, may have to stick around and do <laughs> some more of the missions in the area and actually uh, explore the planet a little bit more because uh, it's one of the few areas in the system where you actually have a little bit of uh, green and brown. Uh, instead of the usual cold and grey and uh, just nasty, nasty weather. Alright, so there is my target. We have an Aegis Vanguard Warden, it appears. Along with uh, a couple other things, there is an Aegis Hammerhead there that we will have to look out for. Uh... Ooh, looks like possibly a couple hammerheads as well as... Oh, goodness. Goodness gracious. Yeah, we definitely want to... Uh, definitely want to get those shields charged up again. I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, goodness gracious. These things are not kidding.
damage. Well, <laughs> that was uh, that was very very fast. We definitely want to uh, definitely want to not do that in the next round. I'm going to uh, kind of bring in my buccaneer, I think, for the next one because that one's got a little bit more kill power. Um, it's not quite as maneuverable. But we're gonna we're gonna run with that one and see if we can <laughs> see if we can manage to uh, to get this one taken care of. Oh goodness, that was rather strange. Um, I've I've gotten a, gotten a target here. One moment while we get back out there. Okay, so we are back in the area. I've got uh, 32 kilometers to go still, and I'm still traveling at quite a decent clip. So I'm going to bring that speed down a little bit. And I'm going to scan as we come into here. Because I want to make sure that I get a good beat on these guys before we get too close. I'm going to try and string them out a little bit. I've got my, uh, got my decoys turned up to three. Uh, so that as I come in here I can... Go ahead and lock those over, and lock both those in as well. Alright, and we're going to go ahead and zoom out of here now. I'm going to swap full power to shields, and try and get get away from this hammerhead because it's entirely capable of killing us. Whoop! Alright, there we go. So we're going to go ahead and we'll pull around here. There we go. Oh goodness. Yeah, we're taking quite a bit of fire from this saber here. So we're going to go ahead and, and get out here. Try and string them out a little ways. Take that one out. That one's our... go. Alright, so that's got that one. Oh goodness, we're almost out of decoys. Oh. I'm going to try some evasive maneuvering here. Warden, there we go. Yep, I know. Let me go ahead and get our shields charged charge back up here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Out of ammo in my my yellow jackets. There we go. Perfect. We've got that one.
And we're basically just going to try and stay out of the way of these guns on the uh, on the hammerhead here. Shields are down. We'll go ahead and zoom under here and try and avoid these. There we go. This fighter, unfortunately, is not particularly good in atmosphere, so we're just going to have to try and manage this as best we can. Stay out of their line of fire. Oh, goodness, we've lost a, lost a weapon there, and this thing is going to eat us alive if we can't get out of here. So I'm going to go ahead and rotate around a little bit as we continue to hammer away at this. I don't see any hit registrations on our I'm going to see if we can get this thing to smack into the terrain there and Potentially, whoop, no, 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 don't hit us. Keep hammering away at this as we can and try and get the uh, get the shields down. We're pretty close to losing our our shields ourselves, so we're gonna go ahead and Get out of here quickly while we try and let these shields recharge a little bit. No, we're going to go ahead and blow past this thing. Unfortunately, we used all of our missiles on our first shot. And I don't think we're actually going to do a whole lot of damage with this, so... We're going <laughs> to... Goodness, we're taking quite a few hits there. We're going to go ahead and swap back to shields until we get those recharged. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to try the old kamikaze trick. And we'll see if that, uh, see if that takes them out. That was, uh, that was quite a bit of firepower there. So we're going to wake up here. And we'll see if that's completed our mission. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Party disbanded. Objective complete. Subdue bounty. Perfect. So we've gone ahead and gotten that completed. 
we've added our master tracker license earned and we can now get and take the ERT missions um, now at that point then we've got uh, we've got those extreme risk um, extreme risk targets obviously uh, when death of a spaceman comes online uh, killing them by suicide is not going to be the uh, the way to do it but for now uh, especially if you're only in a light ship that's really the only way of doing it unless you carry a whole bunch of missiles with you can get the shields down and are able to then dump those missiles in and you, you'll need you'll need some larger missiles to to take those down as you saw the uh, the four that I dumped into it were not enough to to take it out so okay so we've got the uh, the ERT mission completed um, I think I'm going to end the video right there thank you for watching and uh, I will see you all in the next one take care everyone ta-ta